Um, just giving everybody an update on the, um, the fox kit situation. Both of them survived the night and they're doing great. Um, more than I can say for myself. Um, I'm going to get them out and show you them because they're doing absolutely great and they've just had a feed as well. Here's the larger of the two at 142 grams. Say hi, everyone on Facebook wants to see you. You can see their eyes and ears are still closed. Oh, that's brilliant. And that one's a little boy, as you can see. All right, you go back. We were quite worried about that one because um, it was quite weak yesterday. This one, on the other hand, the smaller of the two, funnily enough, at about 130 grams, um, is, is, is doing brilliantly as well. This one likes to eat a lot. <laughs> She's actually trying to suckle again. He, sorry, is trying to suckle again. Are you looking for more food? You cannot be looking for more food. Let's have a look, see where's that syringe gone? Over here. See if they'll have a little bit of food quickly. There we go. Oh, fantastic. Oh, what a good feed. All right. Oh, milky, 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 milky. There we go. Yeah, both of them are doing really great, and um, hopefully we'll find a, um, a foster for them soon, as in a, an actual fox foster, um, where they can get proper fox milk and learn to be foxes, because we don't want them to be tame. So I'll pop you back there, and I'll just swing the camera around so you guys can see what they're living in at the moment. They're just in there snuggled into a, a hoodie on top of a hot water bottle. They're doing great. And we'll keep you updated. Thanks for following.